as St. Kitts and Nevis joined countries worldwide in commemorating the United Nations World Water Day on 22nd March 2023. Conrad Maynard, St. Kitts and Nevis's Minister of Responsibility for Water Services, is calling on citizens and residents to be proactive and to play their part in water conservation. Speaking from the perspective of a small island developing state, Minister Maynard said the commemoration is being held on the theme Accelerate the Change, saying it is time to change our habits. For the past few decades, our local water experts have been sending out the message, but few of us have been taking heed. The message is simple for all of us to understand. We live on small island state of 104 square miles. All of our fresh water comes from the rain that falls on the island. It does not rain every day, and sometimes it goes for weeks without raining. But we expect to use water every day. If we do not use the little water we have conservatively, we will run out. The experts at the Water Services Department have indicated that over the past 10 years, we have seen about an 18% decrease in the average annual rainfall. This is serious. While we cannot predict the future, we have to be prepared for various scenarios, including longer dry periods and shorter, more intense wet seasons. The bottom line is that as the climate changes, our availability of fresh water will change, and hence we have to adapt. But addressing the water issues on St. Kitts and Nevis will have consequences that require commitment and financial resources. The fact that the last time our water rates was increased was over 22 years ago means that our rates must be affordable. The government therefore expects every customer to willingly pay for the services so that we can continue to invest in the maintenance and improvement of the service. I want to stress, however, that as we build out a more resilient water infrastructure, the government will do what it must to encourage conservation and strongly and boldly discourage wastage. The Water Services Department is inviting the public to its open days on 20th and 21st March at the Labrit Water Treatment Plant and on World Water Day, customers will receive tokens on the payment of their water bills. The commemoration will also include competitions within schools. Glenn Bart reporting for SK Newsline.